Uh, my name is Carly Weisbeck. I'm one of the co-owners of a Boss Athletics. It's a cheerleading gym here in Regina. Um, my other co-owner is Sienna Borland. I've got one of our boss moms here with me today. This is Lynette McGill, Hi. and she's going to tell you a little bit more about one of the uh, Boss Give Back initiatives that we're going to be doing this season. Hi, guys. Um, so my name is Lynette, and I'm one of the parents at Boss, and um, I thought it was important to um, collaborate um, with Boss to do a um, giving back initiative. So we started our Boss Gives Back initiative um, with the gym and uh, teach the kids about giving back to our community. So we've paired up with Thomas Circle of Care to do this suitcase drive and toy drive and we wanted to show you a little bit about what that is and what that entails and how you can help out. Um, so it will be on December 1st. Um, we will be uh, at the gym, Boss Athletics Gym, um, from 10 until 5 that day. And you can bring any um, gently used or new um, suitcases. And these suitcases will be going to the kids who uh, are in transition from either their home to foster care or foster care back home. So, um, uh, we're also going to be collaborating with the Toy Drive, drive with JC Realty. And um, so we're going to do all of that kind of on the one day on December 1st at Boss Athletics. Um, the address of Boss Athletics, sorry, I'm just going to peek here, is 637 Dud Dudney Ave East. Um, I know a lot of you know where that is, but for the folks who are new to the gym, it's located there in Unit D. Um, so I'm going to show you kind of what we're looking for for the suitcases. Um, it's not just suitcases, it can be backpacks, suitcases, any size, um, cinch sacks, um, duffel bags, those sorts of things. So we're going to kind of show you what we're looking for for that. So first is your standard kind of, <laughs> trying to get in the picture there, <laughs> thank you, <laughs> is your kind of standard size um, maybe carry-on or like a medium-sized suitcase. Um, we really want to focus that these are, um, are, are should be in new or like next to new condition. Um, so all the zippers need to be working, all the pockets need to be able to open and close properly, that sort of thing. Um, here's another example. So again, backpacks for kids going to school, um, that sort of thing. Um, and yeah, it can be boy or girl, um, doesn't matter. Um, what else you got there, Carly? <laughs> Got a cinch bag here. Oh yeah, this will work as well. Uh, it's in great condition. Anything like this will work. Mm -hmm. Yep. And then um, here's another example. Uh, I know for my girls, they're becoming older tweens and teens, so their little kids suitcases don't work so well. So it's a great for those little boys or girls that don't have anything right now. We've also got some nice example of toys that you can bring in for the toy drive, which is the same day. Um, so you can bring anything, stuffies, or we really like to have books as well. Um, that's something that we really want to get lots of. Um, just make sure that it is in good condition and that it is next to new or brand new. Um, and if you are like donating a puzzle, make sure that it's in mint condition, all the pieces are there. So. Yeah, um, I think that's kind of it. Um, just one last thing, we will have a, um, uh, at the gym that day, we will have a, um, uh, like a trailer unit or hopefully a few trucks to transfer these items. So if there's something that are smaller, maybe even putting it in a little plastic bag or something would be awesome. So that way it's not going to get dirty or anything. But I think that's it. Thanks everyone. Thank you. Yeah, bye. <laughs>